Hey everybody, welcome back to Team Stitch and Sense. It is the long-awaited Bring Back My Bar, July 2014. Um, my run-through of each of the scents and what I think about it and just, you know, my whole review on it. So, let's get started because this is going to take a while. There's 20 cents. Um, oats and Honey, this is one that has been back not that long ago, so I know what it smells like. I like it. It's got a real mapley scent to me, not necessarily honey. But I think it, it smells more like oatmeal cookies, but with a really heavy maple scent. And I'm going to rip through these kind of fast because I don't want this video like 20 minutes long. Bananarama, again, it, this one was back not that long ago. Smells like banana Laffy Taffy. Exactly. So, you know, Coconut Palm, I do love this one. This one was back a few times ago. Suntan Lotion, definitely, if you love that real coconutty smell, this one's for you. Lemon Coconut Chiffon. Now this is funny because this one just discontinued not that long ago. And it's not a favorite of mine, but it does have that lemon chiffon smell to it. So, Cookie Dough. This one, I was kind of disappointed. I was expecting like a chocolate chip cookie dough. And to me, it smells almost like it's got ginger in it. It smells like cookie dough, but more like a ginger cookie to me. So, I mean, I guess it really didn't specify that on it, but that's my take on it. Cranberry Muffin, I don't remember if this one is back before, but I actually like it, and it's got a really nice cranberry scent to me. It almost reminds me of Blueberry Cheesecake, but with a cranberry instead of blueberry. Lily of the Valley, this one I was really interested in, because this is one I have not smelled before, and I really like it. it it's got a subtle, light, I mean, it's perfumey, but it's not heavy, heavy, you know, like when you had that lady walk past you in the store that feels like, that smells like she bathed in it. You can practically taste it. No. This is a much lighter scent and it is a true Lily of the Valley scent. Flirtatious. We've had this one before. Again, it's a good scent. A lot of people like it. It's very, it's clean and fresh and it, it's got a little bit of a perfume smell but not bad. I mean, it's more of a clean scent in my opinion. Key Lime Tortilla. Now this one I've never smelled before. I can smell the lime. But I'm not getting a lot of tortilla. I mean, that's just me. It, it's okay. I guess it's not one that I'll probably ever warm, but it's okay. Revved up raspberry. I am not a fan of raspberries. Actually, raspberries just don't like me. I can't eat them. But this one I actually like. There were people complaining it smelled like newborn nursery. And I don't, I get, there's a little bit of a powder, baby powder scent in there, but you get that raspberry too. So if it's something that maybe you kind of like newborn nursery, but you don't really want that much baby powder, this is a really good option because it's got just that little touch of raspberry scent to it. And this is one that I actually probably will warm. Um, French Kiss, again, I think this was back a while ago. It's okay. Not my favorite. I think it's too perfumey, too strong for me. Mediterranean Spa. Again, not discontinued that long ago. And again, it's okay. It's It's got that spa, you know, ocean-y kind of scent. But it's a little bit strong for me. Almond cookie. Now, this bugger is almond. Oh, my gosh. Seriously, that's all I get. I don't get cookie. I get almond. Like almond extract that you would get. It has got a really strong almond scent. So if that's something you really like, I would go for it. Um, Mums and Marigolds. This is one that the first summer I was in Scentsy a couple years ago that they had and then they never brought it back. And it's, I like it. It's, it's really got a nice fresh floral scent. It's not too strong, not too perfumey. So I'm glad that they brought this back and I will be stocking up on that one. Echo, I don't even want to smell this. It is terrible in my opinion. I mean, I know a lot of people like it, but it is just, oh, it's like, to me, it smells like bad men's cologne. I'm sorry for those of you that love this. This is why Scentsy has so many scents, because we all aren't going to like the same things, but that is not my scent. Okay, um, let's see. Let's go to German chocolate. Seriously, if you love the smell of chocolate, this is the bar for you. You know, and I was thinking German chocolate. I'm thinking German chocolate cake. I don't know why cake popped in my head, because it doesn't say cake on here, but it smells just like German chocolate. It's got a very strong chocolate scent. I, my suggestion for those of you that sell Velada, if you're doing an event and you're sampling chocolate, 
have a Scentsy warmer kind of tucked in, hidden somewhere, because you're not really supposed to have them out, and put this in it. People will swarm you because it's going to smell like chocolate over there. That's just my, my tip. Cherry almond pie. Again, this one has been back before. I'm not a big fan of it. I mean, it's okay. It's got a really good cherry scent. Some with the pie that just doesn't do it for me, but I know a lot of people like it, so that's a good one. Go, go, goji. This is was back, um, was a bring back my bar the first year I was in, a couple years ago. It's okay. I mean, it's not bad. It's it's not my favorite. I guess I'd warm it just to see how I like it more. But it's not. It's got a good berry scent. And if that's something you're looking for, it's not super strong. So that's kind of nice for those of you that are looking for a lighter scent. Um, apples and pears. I was disappointed in this. I was really expecting like an apple and pear scent. And I mean, it's hard to smell. You can't hardly smell anything. So if you're wanting something really light, it's okay. But it just doesn't really give me that apple and pear scent. I mean, it's I guess it's kind of fresh. You know, you be the judge. Last but not least, fresh cut grass. And this smells exactly like it sounds. It smells like grass. It smells like fresh cut grass. I love this. And actually, for me, I'm, I love mixing this one with, with Thunderstorm. One cube of each, it is amazing. So this is one of my favorites that came back. This one, again, was back that couple Julys ago when I first joined. And um, I didn't realize how fast that one was going to sell out. So, you know. So the exciting thing about this Bring Back My Bar is that they have a special pricing. What ended up happening is our really super adorable, cute warmer of the month did not pass quality standards. They said there is no way they were going to sell it looking like it did, and I'm very happy that they did that because for I know for me, I don't want something that looks like junk. I'm sorry. That's just the way I feel about it. And so they rejected those warmers. They're not going to be able to get it, which I'm sad about, but they gave us a great special for the Bring, bring Back My Bar. And so what you can do is like normally every bar is $5. You can do three bars for $14. You can get six bars for $25. But the special is if you buy 12 bars, you're going to get an extra five bucks off. So you're going to get 12 bars for $45 instead of 50. So that's basically like buying nine and getting three free. That's a really great deal. So if there's any sense you want to stock up on, this is a perfect time to do it. If you're thinking, wow, you know what, I love this stuff. I really need to like do something. Think about joining my team. I mean, really, it's been an amazing journey for me. I absolutely love it. You might notice the purple in my hair because Sensi Family Reunion is next week, so I can't wait. And I will do a report from there as well. But, um, yeah, think about it. It's been a blessing in my life. I love it so much. I can't imagine my life without it. So, anyway, I'm going to cut this short because um, we're running over eight minutes now, and I don't like doing really, really long videos. So, but anyway, um, join my team. Otherwise, all my information is below. If you want to order any of these Bring Back My Bars, let me know. Talk to you later. Bye.